we were talking about the friction saver technique. This is how I do it. You can see, keep them spread. Right here, it's in my slack, pull it, grab it, move it away, tighten it back up. Real easy for me to just move and it cinches back down. Usually use the hitch with less sit back, as you can see. It's just for when I'm doing removals. This is about how close I set them when I'm choking off on like palm trees, just so they they just about meet, but they're always kind of cinched down. And if I'm doing something slippery like a uke, slippery uke. I'll even wrap the whole thing around. More like this. But you gotta be sure you put this one on the top when you wrap it. Otherwise when you pull it, well, get stuck. Then we always pull it so it can unwrap. If that's under, obviously, it'll be pulling back on itself and it'll get stuck. This is about how I'll set it in SRT, the Alpine carabiner. I prefer the retrieval through the friction saver SRT. So I like to do a lot of redirects. Just like choke it up a little tighter. Not like that. <laughs> 